exactly four years ago, 276 female students of the Government Girls Secondary School, Chibok, who were set to write their final year exams, were abducted by Boko Haram. The news of the abduction rocked the world, and what started off as a call by a defiant group of Nigerians rippled into a worldwide campaign for the return of the girls, with world leaders, celebrities, and human rights activists across the globe lending their voices to the call for the return of the Chibok girls. Four years later, 112 girls are still missing. And despite many challenges faced by the Brimbaka Girls Group, the members are defiant as ever as they gather for the second annual lecture to mark the anniversary of the abduction. Beyond the matter of our focus on cheaper girls, we have focused on many other dimensions of the issues in the country. It was by virtue of the advocacy that we have done that the invisibility of the Northeast crisis was thrown open. In an ideal country, going through school only places a burden on the student, the kind of burden that makes you think about how do I make up lecture notes, how do I meet up time of, of lectures. Nothing could have prepared our 219 girls on the night in which they were taken. The chairperson of the event highlights some of the underlying issues that led to the insurgency in the Northeast, which in turn is responsible for the incessant abductions in the region. The lecture that used to extend from Central Africa through to Cameroons, Niger, Nigeria, and Chad, a lake that was over 25,000 kilometers big, has now shrunk to a mere 1,000 kilometers. So we can begin to think how this ecology has affected the, the, the economic activities of that area. The role of the girl child in nation building was also brought to the front burner. In his keynote speech, Pastor Tunde Bakare states that it is important that the girl child knows that her role in nation building is not relegated to the other room. The demand to bring back our captive daughters echoes the demand to bring back the dignity, the potential, and the promise of the Nigerian girl child in every part of the country. It is the realization that the girl child can grow to become a strong and accomplished woman contributing significantly to society as did our forebears. The fact that the Dapchi episode happened four years after the Chibok incident and one year to elections, just as it was in the Chibok case, is evidence of an alarming, an alarming national malady. With 112 girls still missing and unending speculations about their whereabouts and their well-being, the underlying message of the Brimbakal Girls Group is simple. Four years is too long to have the girls in captivity, and they demand that the government take decisive action to bring back the remaining girls. Kayla Megwa, Channels Television News.